Dear viewers, let's start accounting lesson number 5, Accounting Cycle. This lesson will include number 1, what is accounting cycle, number 2, flowchart of accounting cycle and number 3, brief introduction of 10 steps of accounting process. What is accounting cycle? The accounting cycle is a sequence of steps or procedures related to the business accounts. An accounting cycle usually starts and runs across a complete accounting period, usually a fiscal quarter or a year. The accounting cycle begins with the financial transaction of the period and their entry into the journal. It ends when the business closes temporary accounts and publishes financial statements for the period just finished. The accounting cycle First step is identification of transaction. Then we made journal entries and then post that journal entries into the ledger accounts. Then we prepare unadjusted trial balance. Then adjusting entries are made and prepared adjusted trial balance. Through adjusted trial balance, we make the financial statements. Then closing entries are made and post closing trial balance is prepared. At the end, reversing entries are made and hence new year starts again with the identification of transactions. This is the whole process of accounting. Step 1 Identification of Transactions The first step of the accounting cycle is the identification of transactions. Transactions are identified after analyzing all events. The only financial transaction would be considered as a transaction. Step number 2 Generalizing The second step of the accounting cycle is generalizing. Here analyzed transactions are recorded in the primary book of account which is called general journal as debit and credit in chronological orders. Purchase book, sales book, purchase return book, sales return book, note receivable book, note payable book are the primary books of transaction recording. Step number three, posting the ledger. The third step of the accounting cycle is ledger. Ledger is the main book of accounts. Here transactions are transferred into the ledger as a separate head of accounts. Different ledger is prepared for each head of accounts such as purchase account, sales account, salary account, advertisement account, capital account, building account, cash account, deposition accounts, etc. Step number 4. Preparation of trial balance. The fourth step of the accounting cycle is the preparation of the trial balance. It is prepared to testify the mathematical accuracy of the recorded transactions. The trial balance is prepared with the concerned accounts heads along with the debit and credit balances of the ledger. It is prepared at a certain time period. Step number 5. Adjusting Entries The fifth step of the accounting cycle is adjusting entries. The journal entry which is given for adjusting accrued and prepaid incomes or expenses to identify the actual financial condition of a business of a particular accounting period is called adjusting entries, such as adjusting entries for accrued salaries, prepaid insurance premium, unrealized income and expenses, etc. Step number 6. Adjusted Trial Balance The sixth step of the accounting cycle is the preparation of the adjusted trial balance. Here again, the adjusted transaction is transferred to ledger as a separate head of accounts. Then the adjusted trial balance is prepared with the balances of debit and credit of ledgers. Step number 7. Preparation of Financial Statements The seventh step of the accounting cycle is the preparation of financial statements. The financial condition of a business is determined through these financial statements which are number 1 income statement, number 2 balance sheet or statement of financial position, number 3 cash flow statement or statement of changes in financial position, and number 4 statement of retained earnings. Step number 8 closing entries. The eighth step of the accounting cycle is a closing entry. There are two types of accounts in the business. One is income and expense related account, another one is assets and liabilities related accounts. A closing entry is a journal entry that is made at the end of an accounting period to transfer balances from a temporary account to a permanent account. Step number 9. Post-closing trial balance. The ninth step of the accounting cycle is the preparation of the post-closing trial balance. After closing entries, ledger balances of income and expenses become zero. The next accounting period will start with the remaining balances of assets, liabilities and owner's equity accounts. Step number 10. Reversing Entries The tenth and final step of the accounting cycle are reversing entries. Reversing entry is the opposite of the adjusting entry made in the last accounting period. Adjusting entries are made at the beginning of the every next accounting period immediately after closing current year. Next guide on accounting will be lesson number 6. Sales Journal. So keep on connected.